So today's really exciting because we've just picked up the keys to our new home here. And what I thought I'd do is give you a tour of our new house. Jody, this is not your house. What? Okay, I'm only kidding. This is not my house. I dream about living in a house like this, but we have just completed this amazing outdoor kitchen and I'm going to show you everything about that. So this kitchen is very different to any other kitchens that we've built before and the reason for that is the finish on it. So what we've got here is we have got a Decton finish. Uh, so Decton is a product that we use a lot for our worktops um, and, but we usually only use them on the top. We've never before put it on the face. So what we've got here is we built this whole kitchen with concrete blocks and then we used a tricoya. Um, board on the top. Now Tricoya is it's like an MDF but it's really good for outside. It's very stable, it doesn't twist, it doesn't move. So we put Tricoya on the top and then this Decton is 8mm thick and so it's clad on the top and it's clad on the side and it's been mitered on the corner here so you've got this seamless finish and it looks like we've just got this block of Decton and it looks really really good. Um, so let's start over here and so, so this grill here this is a napoleon prestige pro 665 this is an amazing piece of kit it's 304 stainless steel um, all the grids everything inside are stainless steel it's got lights inside it's got an infrared back burner there it comes with a rotisserie um, all of this lights up it's got a sensor underneath so every time you walk near it the lights come on you probably can't see it in the sunlight here but when you push and turn it on the button turns red so you can tell which burners are on that is a really really awesome piece of kit underneath we've got a single cupboard here and so we're going to have uh, the gas tank in there that's going to be connected up and then to the side here literally just two drawers for storage just for keep keeping whatever you want to keep in there coming along here we've got a beef eater double fridge keeping all your drinks cool your food cool um, over here we've got a stainless steel sink and a tap and underneath there just a single door and that literally provides access to all the utilities underneath there and storage as well um, to the left of that we've got here a pull out tank drawer so that is going to be used for a bin you can use it to put your propane sink in but we always use them for putting bins in um, come across to here you've got a double access cupboard now this cupboard is actually <clears throat> pardon me it's been lined out inside um, with like a waterproof plastic lining so the customer is going to keep cushions in there um, from their table and chairs um, it can also store the tank for the Gosney uh, pizza oven um, and that brings us on nicely just above us um, is the new Gosney dome um, so I don't know a lot about these we don't sell them ourselves but the customer got them themselves they are a really good um, pizza oven their gas their dual fuel I think wood and gas um, so it'll be interesting to see how, how he gets on with these so I hope you've enjoyed this video and this incredible um, outdoor kitchen. We really enjoy building this one. Um, if you want to see another video like this, I'll leave a link to another one up here. Um, so you can click on that and see another one. If you're looking for some inspiration for an outdoor kitchen, if you're thinking of having one um, and you just want some ideas, um, please hit the like button if you've enjoyed it. That really helps the channel. Uh, so thanks very much for watching this video. We're going to bring some more to you very soon uh, and we'll see you on the next one.